Hi, my name is Mike. Welcome to the Purple Elephant. question for you, uh, furniture. Uh -huh. So what's the percentage you offer? 65% goes to here and 45% goes to the customer. Do we have to sign a contract? Yes, ma'am. Okay, and for how many days? 45 days. 45 days, okay. How about on the layway? What percentage do we get? 45 and 65. Okay, well it was nice. Talking to you, you have a beautiful uh, furniture in the store. Thank you very much, Mr. Thank Hustle. you. Well, I've been here for two years, and I like it. When I first got this job, I thought I wasn't going to go make it through the make it through the whole work period. Well, tell us what you do here at the Purple Elephant. Well, we I vacuum this carpet before. Mm -hmm. That's a lot of carpet to vacuum, huh? Yeah, and then I'm the salesman on Thursdays. I used to be the salesman on on Tuesdays and Thursdays, and then they put somebody else in that spot. I work from 9.30 till 2.30. I sweep in there, and, I, and the rest of them mop. So, do you remember our trainings back in 2007? Self, Charter Mason. Right, and what does that mean to you, Mike? Freedom and choices. Can you tell us about that? What kind of freedom and choices do you have in your life today? I have a home. Uh -huh. I have my own room. I have a job. And 2008 was a good year. So tell me about the people in your life who help you out. Who are all the people that help you? I had a staff in back in May and it was, and it was okay. Okay, so, so were people from your circle of support there? Yeah, the, Joe was there, Joe and Mary, and my foster dad, foster mom, and Colleen, my case manager, and Debbie was there, Debbie Floyd. Okay. Yeah. So you lived in a state school, a nursing home, a group home, and now a foster home? Yeah. Have you lived anywhere else? This is my second foster home in my life. Okay. Hello, my name is Frank Posada. I'm the foster care provider for Mr. Michael Mocky. He's my new son. He's not my consumer. He's not my another guy. He's my real son, right, son? Right. All right. So I'm real happy with him, and I have a lot of potential to The thing is, uh, when I, uh, when the company offered me, and when I see Michael, he was uh, another different person right now. And, uh, and now Mike, uh, he works in the Purple Elephant, but uh, now Mike one probably change another job, tries another, you know, opportunity, another place, restaurant, whatever. And he told me now, uh, probably works in the Whataburger. And uh, Michael is real excited right now. So do you have new people in your life since you moved here? His whole family. How's that going? <laughs> you like them? Yeah, I like, like it. You? His brother does. Today. He like a Michael a lot. And uh, he, uh, you know, joking each other. Michael say, uh, I love you so much. And my brother said, oh, I love you too. And then doing this. And we have a picture with that uh, thing. And we're doing a barbecue with my family. And my family doesn't speak English. So when you talk to Michael, hey dad, your dad told me this, and, and we need to translate it sometime because uh, <laughs> he understands Spanish very well. And uh, my dad said, Dile al muchacho, so I told the guy, it's a real nice white guy, gringo. Yeah. And he said, Tony, I love you. And now and he's my grandpa. All right, now you're grandpa. <laughs> and now uh, after this, um, probably this future for Michael and the Whataburger, uh, Michael, uh, Promise me he's gonna be uh, good the rest of the year. He's gonna be uh, more responsible in his job. He's gonna wake up early all the time. And I promised to him a big new, uh, big <laughs> stereo system, right? Right. Well, let's yeah. talk some more about Whataburger. That's where you wanna work, right? Yeah. Yeah, and what would you like to do at Whataburger? Come on. Just mop and sweep and clean the table. 
Okay, okay. So you need to go for a job interview, don't you? Yeah. Who's going to help you with that? Cindy, I'm ready to go work at Whataburger. All right. Okay. okay. What kind of things do you think you would do working at Whataburger? Clean the tables, sweep them up, and I think I'm ready. You think you're ready? Yeah. Great. Well, we have an interview scheduled for you for next week uh -huh. with the manager of the Whataburger that's out close to your house. Right. And um, we will make sure that you're prepared for that and have the application. We'll fill it in and take it with us. I think mostly you'll probably be working in the dining room area, which, yeah. is, which is what you had stated that you wanted to do. Yeah. You know what? What's that? They get half price. If you work there, you get half price on the meal. Oh, that's the best part of working at Whataburger, isn't it? Whataburger, Whataburger, yeah! So what do you look forward to in the future? What are your goals for the future? A apartment. Okay, your own apartment? Yeah. You're going to have roommates or live by yourself? A roommate. Yeah. Two-bedroom apartment. I'm going to try to hook up with a girlfriend. Yeah, is that one of your goals for the future then? Yeah. Are you working on that? Yeah. So you're looking forward to a new job. You'd like to get an apartment of your own and live with your girlfriend. Are there any purchases you want to make in the future? Things you're saving your money for? Yeah, uh, like new clothes. You like dressing up? Yeah. Tell me what your favorite thing to do is. What is your most favorite thing to do? It's go out to eat. Go out to eat, all <laughs> right. And go get a lot of tickets. All right. What's the most important thing for people to know about my small I can make my own choices.